I'm sorry, okay? I'm sorry. Don't hold that against me, okay? <laughs> my fellow fragrance lovers welcome to my very first vlog your girl decided to do something different this vlog i did do it when i went to california and i know it's been a while it's been a while and i know i was supposed to upload this to y'all and i am so so sorry but i'm a perfectionist well sometimes anyway but i'm also a procrastinator other times but you know i'm sorry okay i'm sorry listen this is when I went to California, and um, we drove to California. Well, we drove through California, let me say that. We also went to Vegas, so you're going to see some clips from Vegas. I got a chance to vlog. I went to Neiman Marcus, got my nose, of course, on some fabulous fragrances, and went to Kriegler. You know, you can't go to California and don't go to the Kriegler store. Like, that's just like, you know, what's the purpose of going to California if you're not going to go past the Kriegler store, right, right, right? I went past the Kriegel store, got my feelings stepped on all the way because the prices went up. <laughs> yes, they did. The prices went up. You know, I thought I was going to get my English promenade. <laughs> Suffice it to say, she's still in the store. But I did get an opportunity to purchase uh, the soap. Yes, I bought some very bougie, expensive soap. And I'm going to blame that on my girl, Fab Fines by Keetra, because she was the one who said that I had to have this soap because the soap was fabulous. And I'm, I'm going to believe her because guess what? That soap is still wrapped up because to the tune of almost $80, I don't think I'm ready to quite put her onto the water yet. No, she might not have even see the water, okay? <laughs> and there's some other things that I got a chance to do, but you'll see it in the vlog, you know. Got a chance to eat some amazing food. Got I, I had a lot of Mexican food, which, you know, my purpose was to go because I'm like, I've never really had authentic Mexican food. So I wanted to, you know, get an opportunity to do that. So I did have an opportunity to do that. Ate myself silly. But y'all will see. So to the vlog. <laughs> my channel my name is Jessica and on this channel I talk about fragrances that's right over the top top fabulous fragrances over the top top fabulous fragrances destination will be on the right. Your destination is on the right. It is 
said to be the scent of the Beverly Hills. Oh. I think of it as more of a Los Angeles smell, but I might be biased. Okay. Um, the carrying notes are bergamot, cardamom, cedarwood, coriander, green tea, jasmine, lily of the valley, orange blossom, rose, and sandalwood. But very subtle. Okay. Thank you. Oh, that is pretty. Why didn't I smell that the last time I was here? <laughs> well, I like to think that it's good to do it in increments. Yeah, definitely for my wallet. <laughs> But also, you always discover something new. Okay. How do you say this one again? Zilt style. Zilt styles. Okay, and I'm sorry. Go ahead. It's uh, what now? It is zilt is actually a German island, and so I feel very ashamed since I come from Europe. I didn't even know that German has holiday islands, but this is the most famous one. Okay. It has very pristine beaches and uh, very upscale clientele, so to speak. Okay. Um, it is it is done so to represent the cashmere smell that you you get around those higher echelons of people. Okay. So like I said, it is a very warm and spicy, some would even say masculine scent. Um, it was made in, it was actually released in July of last year, so July of 2021. Okay. Uh, however, as you may see on the label, the batch itself mm -hmm. uh, was the second scent of 2020. Okay. So that's why it's 222. Oh, okay. Um, okay. Palais Monash. Palais Monash. Yes. We'll go with that. <laughs> <laughs> um, Palais Monash. So the batch was as you may see, done in 2018. It takes about three years to make a single batch. Really? Yeah. Um, however, it was released uh, at the beginning of December of last year, so December of 2021. Uh, out of all 42 that you see in front of you, mm -hmm. this one is by far the most complex one. Okay. So you have the Abracadabra, and you're yes. familiar with that. Uh, yes. And it, this one was the most complex. I absolutely yeah. love that one. This one like, takes it down. Okay. It's strong. So the first thing that's going to hit you are going to be cinnamon and vanilla. And it's very sweet, very potent. Once it settles, the middle notes are, and you're going to laugh, are modeling cake, whipped cream, milk, hair. Uh, Patchouli, jasmine, orange blossom, sandalwood, amber, musk, vanilla, and tonka. So all in all, very sweet fragrances. Mm -hmm. But the complexity of it, once they're all put together, how it develops on your skin and even on that paper, it's amazing. This is the infamous tray, y'all. These little beauties go for about a thousand, a little over, plus tax. Get your dollars ready if you come in the creek. But I guarantee you, nobody else will have it. You will have an exclusive fragrance because there's only one made. Definitely worth you getting your nose on. These will be my next pickups from Kriegler. In this particular order, these are definitely must-haves in my collection. To be added before the end of the year. This was a real buffalo. I'm very dead now, but it's twenty thousand uh, dollars. If you have the coin, then you're interested in owning uh, this um, 
what used to be a real buffalo. I mean, look at him, y'all. Look at my balls. Ooh, child. Can you imagine this thing running up on you in the dark of the night? I can't. <laughs> Like I said, it's my very first vlog, and I would really like to, you know, bring some more different kind of content, still fragrance-related content to the channel, but I want to bring what y'all want to see. So please leave me a comment. Let me know what you would like to see moving forward. I got so much content prepared for y'all that I'm, I'm planning to bring to the channel, but I also want to ask your input. What would you like for me to bring to you so that I give you the content that what you want to see? You know how much I love to interact with y'all. And <laughs> you know I'm nosy like that. So you know when you leave me a comment, I'm coming in there and I'm going to respond. So I'm looking forward to conversing with you guys, chatting with you, and just seeing what's been going on because I've missed y'all. So until our next video, I look forward to talking to y'all. look forward to sniffing more fragrances for y'all, bringing some fabulous content to the channel, and just having lots of fragrance shenanigans fun. So until our next video, y'all take care. I'll talk to you soon. Bye now.